Okay, so I'm out here at Blue Horizons. This is KB Home. And uh, just because inventory is so scarce, I stopped by to ask them what they might have available. And so there, this is the model that they have. I'm gonna run you through. There is this same floor plan under construction with an estimated completion date of October. It's priced at 308,990. And uh, the configuration will be three bedrooms plus a den, two and a half bathrooms. This would be that den right up in front, which is a nice little office work workspace. One thing, so I just I just asked, and now that I walk in, I see this would definitely be an upgrade, and I would have hoped that they would have done that in the subject that I'm speaking of, but there's really just no telling right now. She took off, so. It, uh, she did say that it'll have vinyl flooring except in the great room and in the bedrooms. This one obviously has upgraded everything, right? Because it's the model. But a really nice open floor plan, as you can see. 2,300 plus square feet. So for that kind of money at 308, 990, that's, uh, that's a bargain. Now, KB Home does have their own in-house lender, but they do not offer any incentive for using them. So, I think I mentioned recently that I've got a client that is buying another home that's in this same community. And the, the builder there takes the earnest money and applies that towards your closing costs, which is kind of tricky, but you know, it's their contract. When you buy a new home, we are writing it on the builder's contract and that's the way they do it. And so it's kind of like sleight of hand. They offer $5,000 or up to $5,000 towards closing costs, but then they don't really even pay it because you don't need that much and they've used your first two. So in this case, you could use your own lender I've got a lender that, uh, in, the, in, in her case, offered some closing cost assistance to get the deal. That's Mark Castellanos over at Network Funding, who, by the way, I'll say he is uh, bilingual. I'm going to run upstairs real quick. And I consider Mark my son as well, so I raised Mark and... I'll just disclose that. <laughs> nice loft area up top here. Great mountain views. That looks out over at the White Tank Mountains. And so all these homes are going quick. She kind of laughed at, you know, like, why do you want to go take a video? <laughs> I was like, uh, that's what I do. She's like, it just came back on the market today. And I'm surprised I didn't sell it, she tells me. So that's just our market, right? People are moving here. And... They need a house to live in. So these houses are going pretty quick. Huge laundry room, look at that. Not a fan of upstairs laundry, but you don't have much of a choice. I like the floor plan, I really do. It, it flows nice. Upstairs bedrooms 
and a downstairs den. Let's see, look, that's Australia Mountains out there. So you got the mountains of the West Valley, the Australias, which are down in Goodyear, south of Goodyear. And then you've got the white tanks, which run up through Buckeye. This floor plan makes a lot of sense. Three bedrooms upstairs. Two bathrooms upstairs. A loft upstairs. A den down and a half bath. Great use of the space. And then this kitchen is wide open. Oh, she also did mention that Whoever had that house that uh, is this same floor plan built, they had a, like a chef's kitchen designed, but they did not choose appliances. So at 308,990, the home does not include appliances. And so it sounds like to me, that person wanted to maybe buy either, you know, high end appliances or buy the same kind of stuff, but <laughs> pay cash for it. Sometimes the builders are real expensive. But, some, it, but it might have just been that they had a preference on a, a make. Like a certain stove, I could see. And if the builder would allow you to omit it, then all the better. Okay, so... Uh, the, the subject that I'm talking about also has the extended patio that's on this home, which shows, because so that looks like it's about 22 or so feet. That's a nice size patio. All right, Andrew Texador with HomeSmart. I've got to go collect a sign up in Peoria at Investancia in a home that Finally closed yesterday. It closed late. It was a hassle, but it closed. Okay, so thanks for watching. If you have any questions, if you want to buy any of these new homes, they really go quick. And uh, so really, all they're asking for here at KB Home is, like I said, a $2,500 earnest deposit. And... If you're using your own lender, you'd have to have a pre-qualification letter, letter from them or KB Home will do your loan. They don't offer an incentive, but you can get qualified right here. How you doing, my friend, Vinny? All right, so we're done here. Checking out. Thanks for watching.